me with good luck and put the crown back on my head because guess who's here? The theory queen and she gonna lay a theory to you. Lay a theory on you about MCD, MCD, MCD. Okay, I'll stop. But every time I do a theory, I'm gonna say that. Now, three theories are here. If you haven't told the first episode, then please do not watch it. If you do watch and you haven't told the first episode, that's your loss and you're gonna get spoilers. Now, if you don't know, if you don't have Instagram or Twitter or Facebook, you won't know that Aaron is dead. Officially dead. Most of us knew it. Some of us are like, Aaron should be alive. I bet he's still alive. I bet he's with Zane somewhere. People are saying that. And I was like, no, he dead. He dead. That's what I was thinking the whole time. But now, there's official, officially, we know that he's gone. The exact Aaron equals Shad. Now, you might be like, what? Now, if you didn't see the end of the episode, Shad was in Aaron's body. Now, what I'm trying to say is, Shad is doing, using Aaron's body as a vessel to walk around with so he can control his pattern better than he was in that spirit form. So, bam. So that's pretty much giving you information. Now, theory two, what will happen when Travis and Zane meet? Now, since Zane doesn't have his demonic relic thing anymore, I don't know what it's called. They didn't officially say its name. Um, um, and Travis, the demon warlock's son. For some reason to me, I feel like Zane's going to try to take advantage of Travis. Because Travis isn't full... Well, it's been three years. He probably knows him good enough. But he could try to get Travis angry. I don't mean angry, but like let out his power and just go crazy. And then he could use Travis as somewhat of a bodyguard. Number three, Garmel. All you Garmel fans are going to like this. Now, since Aaron's dead, a lot of people are going to hate me for saying this. Which means, yep, which means Aramel is no longer an MCD. It's in everywhere else, but it isn't an MCD anymore. Well, technically it still is, because she, she still has a kid of him, of him, yeah. And Lawrence is out of the picture. And Dante's married, and Brendan's married. And Travis is Travis. And Garf's on the boat with Aphmau traveling around with kids. For some reason to me, we don't really officially know, but they were somewhat flirting. Just a little teeny bit. Which might mean Garmel is, is a thing. Or he might be acting as a dad figure to the little girl that is actually... Her, is, her dad is Aaron. Which is bye-bye, isn't here no more. I feel so mean to the people who love Aaron, but it's true. Don't hate me, it's true. And if you don't believe me, go get Twitter and Instagram. Uh, so, Garmel might be a thing, or soon to become a thing. So, those are my theories on you. I hope you guys enjoy this video, and you know. Keep thinking, my lads. Now, bye. Mind my horrible singing. Oh yeah, and if you haven't saw my last video, please go watch it. It is the anthem for Donald Trump. You gotta watch it. It's a good song. I made it up. Bye.